All right, we're gonna go out in the lake today, and um, the goal is to go up a creek, though. I've been wanting to scout this creek. This is a popular area where people get to fish. People come here all the time. I've, I've bass fished here with some guys, but uh, I don't think I've ever, I've waded part of this creek like a bunch of years ago, and I've always wanted to go to this little section, and I don't even know if we can get to it. So the goal is to kind of get to this little creek. It's really hot in the summer right now. Also, there's a lot of bass through here. We're gonna bass fish, but if we can get to this creek, if we can get to a section that I think that we can get to, there should be a lot of bass uh, loaded up right there. I'm gonna go over to that bank and work down that way. Our goal is to work back into that corner back there. You got a spinner bait or anything? Yeah, that's what I'm throwing right now. Okay. Cause uh, I'm just switching to something. I'm, I'm doing a little like chatter bait, but a spinner bait, this looks perfect. There's one. There's one. Oh yeah. Oh, I got a nice one. Yeah. Dude, check that out. You know this tree here. I switched to the booyah melee, and it's shallow and murky over here. A lot of trees and grass, and that dude crushed it. 18 incher. That's one of those shallow summertime bass up here in the shade. Very lively. Good fish. Good healthy bass there. Man, where have you been in some of my tournaments? All right, we're kind of working our way back to this creek. We're going to, I think we're getting closer to the mouth of it. <laughs> and uh, there may be more fish as we get closer there, but that was nice. The water should start getting a little clearer up in here too. There's a lot of bait fish in here. There's definitely could be some bass. Yeah, I'm not seeing many bait fish up into this point. The water's getting clearer in here. We're gonna go, it should get really clear as we get upstream. Oh yeah. There's one. I saw a wake on that one. Dude, that's a nice one. If I get this in, I'm gonna have to get you to get a picture. Yeah, I'm coming. I saw them come over and smoke that. Oh, that's a yeah. monster. <laughs> nice. He was in the middle, but he was like up a tree right there. So just keep casting. We're gonna see if we can get any further or not. Man, that's another just, look at that chunky, uh, probably 18 inch, I didn't put him on the board, but I bet he weighs more than that first one. Such a good fish. They're in there chasing shad in this creek channel, so I'm glad we decided to come back in here. All right. <laughs> he came over with a vengeance too. So we're working our way back into here. But it looks like there might be a a blockage, but I want to keep going because I know there's fish further upstream. I really didn't know if it'd catch anything. I didn't know what it was going to be like, but yeah. Oh, he said. Yeah, that's a good one. Connor's got a nice one. It's the second one, too. So we both got two fish. Dude. What's your time with him? I don't have a net. Yeah, that's all right. Just... I didn't. Yeah, you can pick him up into it. Come in there. Nice. Oh, dude, that is a Dude, that's a good fish. Nice. All right, we got two apiece up in here. 
that's a really nice fish. That's that's one of those days you're just glad to get that. And we really ain't been out that long, so the uh, the creek channel's definitely paying off. We've gotten three out of the creek channel, and I got one like kind of at the head of it. One in, one right at the head of it. Yeah. So I know there's more. We got to figure out a way to get back in there. I think this might work. Take everything down. Oh yeah. Well, I'm about to get through here. Connor's back there fishing, caught another one. So, I don't know how far we can get. I see a tree up there, but I think we can get around that one. So, I think it's gonna be worth cutting off a few of these limbs. Might have to slide underneath here though. Could stand up, I guess. Might have been easier, I don't know. Is the seat gonna make it? I think so. Yep, you're clear. Uh, oh, he's gonna do the standing. The standing might have been easier, but it's easier to fall to <laughs> just balance yourself for you. Yeah, can you fold the seat down? Because it's not going to make it like that. You're going to have to fold it down. What if I go this way? Uh, yeah, there you go. Hey! We're through. Let's get more fish. I was so scared I was going to flip my kayak. <laughs> I was waiting for it to happen. But, all right, more fish are coming. Do what? This is some scenic fishing. Yeah. We got a bridge and then we got a like a, a dam here with this like log. All right, we just made it over this like log jam right here and we've come up, but the, I didn't realize the creek splits. So I think we're gonna go back that way, but first we're gonna go upstream. And I still have a goal of going like really far up this creek. The creek has not disappointed. It's been awesome. The water's getting clear. It's turned into rock, more like a real creek style. And I think we're about to hit some really shallow water and I. That might be right where some, some bass are. So I think I'm gonna change up a couple lures that I have on there and um, just, just get ready for whatever. Oh, <laughs> oh I missed it. Did you chase it in? Little guy, crushed up him. Wow, he was hungry. This guy's like eight inches long, but he's thick. That's how they get big up in here. They eat, 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 eat. Look at that. It's getting shallower, clearer. We're getting further up. All right, well, we got all the way up the creek. The goal, I want to just walk. I think there's a couple deep pools right up there. So we're just gonna kind of get out and walk upstream just a little bit. Oh, there's one. I just thumped it as soon as I hit the water. Little guy. Makes my drag. That's a spot. A little spotted bass, a little chubby spot. I got that on the little uh, dark sleeper. <laughs> look at that little guy. Look how fat he is. He ate that thing. He's right out there in the middle.
Well, there wasn't as much up the creek as I thought. We went up a little ways, real beautiful. I think, uh, I think I caught one up there, but we're gonna turn around, start working way back, and but we went up one side of the island, we're gonna go back down the other side, and it's a whole new section. So it's like, it's a brand new area. So I'm excited to see what it looks like. Oh, there's one. Oh, what's that? What's that? <laughs> yeah, bugs are swarming me. We went down the other channel and uh, it's deep in here. Little guy. Here, throw me one. I might go ahead and have it on here. See if I can make it in the kayak. Why do they got a sink? Can't get it, can't get it on there. I have a brand new pack that I just opened. Oh, you got it? <laughs> oh my. Go, 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 go. Yeah, I just saw a couple of good, bad. And they didn't go for my yum dinger. That little guy, right? Got it. There you go. There's two little, there's so many bats. There's a ton of bats in here. No, we threw my, we threw my lure off right away. I saw a couple big ones. They didn't go after the lure. I threw over here the little ones. And uh, they went and picked it up right away. Oh, I got hit. Oh, man. That was like a two and a half pounder probably. He came up and hit it at my kayak and let go. There's a good one. That one? Yeah. Better bait? Yep. Got a little tree. Nice. <laughs> Another good one. Ah, switch to a spinner bait. That's probably a 16 incher. Working our way back out of the creek. And that is a pound three quarter. Nice. I put on a spinner bait and I'm just gonna go back to the same bank where I caught my first fish because it's still shady over here. And then we're gonna go get something to eat. So, what a day. It's been a really good day. Not, a, not just a ton of fish, but just a cool, cool experience. Good day on the lake. Like, I haven't had a day on a lake in a while where I've caught this many fish and just good quality. So, Man, that was nice. There's another one. <laughs> Man, they're loaded up on this bank. I would be getting putting together a good five fish limit. About 12, 13 inches. Better bait. Gotta get it close to that bank. Oh, yeah. Dude, they are tight on that bank. Oh, man. 
and I used to not being in my pedal drive on the lake. Kind of different. I could have just back pedaled out of here. Instead, the wind blew me right, right up in it. Oh, 13, 14 incher. He got it pretty deep. Sorry about that, buddy. Man, it's been a good day. I'm glad I hit some more banks. That right there was a fun day on the lake, catching some good quality fish. I haven't had a day where I fished on a lake and caught that good quality fish. And I don't know how long, maybe since like, like spring probably. I wasn't sure what the fish was gonna go. I, I thought maybe we were gonna kind of catch more fish in the creek. Turns out it caught more in the lake. And when they're munching a the spinner bait or that chatter bait, that is, that I love that, that is so fun. Uh, on the way back, I caught three, the fastest three I caught were like in the last 30 minutes and they were holding tight to the bank. I was flipping up on the bank and they were just grabbing it. And they were 13, 14, maybe a 15 incher. Oh, I caught one, maybe a 16 incher there. So I don't typically take the Sholey out on the lakes. And I don't even know if I have really taken it on the lakes, maybe once or twice, but it's uh, it actually does really well. Like it was flying. Uh, Connor's got a, a feel free lure um, and I'm paddling. And every time we start paddling, I'm like getting way ahead of him. That, that kayak, I forget how fast it is. It's awesome in the current, but it's awesome, awesome on the lake. So that's just a little extra bonus plug. I wouldn't even got to mention anything about the, the kayak, but it does pretty good on the uh, lake as well. I was going to try to use certain lures today and I started off trying those lures, but I brought a few extra stuff. I always bring extra. And I was like, I got to go. I'm going to use these lures. That was what I had in my mind. That quickly changed. The situation was different. I just, the way the water was a little murky. The way um, I, we saw a bunch of shad um, and like just a couple different things changed. And then after I caught that first really good one on the melee, the booyah melee, that bladed jig, I was like, all right, this, I think this is going to be it. So I threw the mag draft. I had a hit or two. I caught one or two on a, a yum dinger, but everything was on a spinner bait or the a bladed jig and they were crushing it. So really fun day. Uh, probably not. We weren't even out here five hours. I think it's almost two. We started at nine. Just really good time. Now it's time to go get some food. Thanks for watching.